Wheel and Sprocket has been in Brookfield for nearly 40 years, but lately... And this building is just out of date. It has a lot of issues. Owners are pedaling uphill and they need a boost. And I think an e-bike is a good metaphor for that evolution. Co-owner Noel Kegel is proposing a radical change to his property, rezoning the land for 64 apartments and 10 townhomes. Wheel and Sprocket would remain on the ground level. In this general area, that would be the tallest building around. Karen and Richard Bowen live off of Capitol, not far from the site. When he told me about it, we both went, wait a minute, a five-story building? You know, that's out of character. It doesn't fit in the neighborhood. They're circulating a petition to get the city to put the brakes on the project. So far, more than 300 have signed on. I haven't met anybody that thinks it's a good idea. Not one. A building of this size at this location at Capitol Drive and Little Road is going to be a significant change for that neighborhood. Brookfield's community development director and mayor stress the project hasn't been approved yet. The city still needs to review the impact of increased traffic and get public input. It obviously does increase traffic some, but that area can really accommodate it. The city hopes the proposal keeps a longtime local business in Brookfield. The Bowens just want to know why so big? Yeah, you know, a uh, great question. The property needs to generate a certain amount of revenue for it to be economically feasible, and that's where we landed. Now, part of this property is this old gas station behind me, and the city says there is some contamination on this property that would need to be cleaned up before moving forward. There are two options for the public to weigh in on this matter and two dates to remember, September 14th and September 20th. Reporting in Brookfield, Brett Lemoyne, Fox 6 News.